This tip is going to save you hours when you're editing vertical video. All right, happy new year, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. This year, I wanna post a lot more short form tips and tricks types of videos, and this one is going to save you hours if you're editing vertical content in Premiere Pro or DaVinci Resolve. This is not a Final Cut Pro video. I do not use Final Cut Pro, so I'm sorry, but I'm sure what I'm going to tell you is going to translate to Final Cut Pro, so stick around and maybe you can figure out the same way to do it like that. So it's 2023 and vertical content is just kind of king right now. Whether you're doing it professionally or just for a hobby, we're filming everything vertical, which means a lot of the times now our cameras are physically shooting vertical, but most cameras are still going to give you a 16 by nine image it's not going to automatically flip it vertical unless you're shooting on like Sony or certain cameras that actually do it for you, which is very convenient. But if you're shooting on a camera that doesn't, I'm going to show you a quick tip here that is going to save you tons of time when you're editing. So if you're editing your vertical videos in Premiere or DaVinci Resolve and you are pulling it into the timeline and then manually rotating it 90 degrees for each clip, you're wasting so much time. I used to do this all the time until I figured out this trick that cuts out all of the tedious work involved. Here's what you wanna do starting with Premiere Pro. First thing you wanna do is double click that first clip in your bin. That's gonna bring it up into the viewer or the preview. And now what you wanna do is go to the effects tab, type in transform, grab that transform effect and drop it right on top of that footage. Now go to the effects panel on that clip. Now rotate that 90 degrees or minus 90 degrees depending on which direction your camera was shooting in. Now, highlight the transform effect right up here, copy that. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go back into your bin, highlight the rest of your clips, and paste it. Now you've just pasted that effect on the rest of your clips, which means all of the rest of your clips are going to be transformed and they're gonna be rotated. Now you can edit in your vertical timeline without having to rotate each individual clip. Now, one thing to remember, when you're shooting vertical video, make sure that your camera stays in the same orientation. Don't have the hand grip up sometimes and then the hand grip down, otherwise your clips are going to be different and you're going to have to go clip by clip and you're gonna have to rotate them 90 degrees or minus 90 degrees and it's not gonna be as cohesive or fast. So one thing to consider when you're doing this. Now, let's go into DaVinci Resolve and it's even easier than doing it in Premiere. What you wanna do in DaVinci Resolve is highlight all of your clips in your bin, select clip attributes, now select rotate 90 degrees right or rotate 90 degrees left, again, depending on which way you are shooting with your camera. And that's literally it. Now all of your clips are vertical and you can edit as usual without having to rotate each individual clip. This is such a simple thing that I wish I knew earlier because I've burned so many hours of editing individually rotating clips as I was going along. But that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you found it helpful and I hope that it speeds up your editing process. If you're not already, consider subscribing to the channel. Be sure to like this video and say what's up in the comments. I will see you all in the next one.